Hello everybody, this is Barry at Rimmers Music in Blackpool and I'm just here to show you this uh, X-Display Korg PA1000 keyboard. It's absolutely brilliant, 61 keys, it's got built-in speakers as well. And I'll just show you the screen, sorry, excuse the light bouncing off, it's difficult for me to get rid of that, but there you go. Nice touch screen there, so you can just press the different categories and change the voices and the styles as you see fit. Let's go back there. Uh, keyboard's in really good condition as you can see. There's no dents on it or scrapes or anything like that. Now what we do have, I'll just do this slowly so I don't make everyone dizzy, is just on the corner, can you see it? It's just there. there. Little marks. I don't know how they've got there, but they're there. But you can't really see them at all. Uh, and if you're playing it, you certainly wouldn't see them. Uh, let's just go around the side here. There you go. Let's have a look at that side. And around the back. Um, let's try not to trip over this wire. That'd be great, wouldn't it? Uh, there you go. So we've got there are your sockets. So we've got video out there. You can output the uh, display to an external screen. Uh, USB, uh, so you can plug a USB flash drive into it or you can uh, plug it into your computer. Uh, pedal input, so you assign a little damper, damper you sustain. MIDI, uh, well everyone wants MIDI don't they? Or you can plug it into another keyboard or a um, module or something like that if you're wanting to control it. Uh, very old school. Uh, audio out, oops, focus on that. Audio out, um, so you can connect it into your external amplification, PA, and so on and so forth. So great if you if you want to make it louder, basically. And audio in, so you can plug in a, a microphone or a guitar, um, and then not use the internal effects and things like that. So it's really good. Uh, let's just go further across. There you go. Like that. Oh, let's just get up so I can move around there. Uh, okay. There's the side. Again, it's it's in really good, nice condition. Um, we've only had it on display on the wall, so it's not really something that people will go over to and hack and bash around, you know. Um, let's go all the way. Yeah, there you go. Okay. Uh, now we've got the box for we've got the box for this. Uh, the original box. There's a music rest as well, and obviously you get the. Uh, power cable as well. Uh, no stand included, this is just a stand we put on just to show you for presentation purposes. Um, look, it's got little lights in the knobs. That's pretty clever, that. I quite like that. Okay, there you go. Right, so what I'll do is I'll just pan off now in true cinematic fashion look uh, and uh, then we'll cut to a, a little video that I've created uh, just to me playing something just basic really on the keyboard. Um, I have damaged my middle finger on my right hand, I will tell you that. So you won't see me doing loads of twiddly bits, as people call it, quite frankly, because I can't. Uh, so until that eventually heals, I'm stuck with effectively three fingers and a thumb. So there you go. Uh, Korg PA1000. Uh, get it if you want it. Just buy it. It's a brilliant keyboard. It's well worth the money. Uh, see you later. Bye-bye.